Hey Scrappers, Tom from iScrap, and we had a question about recy re the recycling of tantalum, what it is, where it can be found, and different uses for it. So in front of me, this, I have a tantalum pipe, and tantalum can be a very expensive metal, and it's certainly not going to be something that you find every day. As the 73rd element on the periodic table, tantalum is generally found in only a few countries throughout the world. Uses for tantalum are not things that you would think of or see often if you've even ever heard heard of the word tantalum before. Now tantalum is not going to be used in everyday devices that you would have in your house that you would scrap regularly, but once in a while you might have someone that says, hey, I have some tantalum or I work with something and it's really in uh, really important for you to know. Now we're recording this in 2022 and in the past we've had prices of tantalum as low as $10 and as high as $150 per pound. Now tantalum can be found in a variety of industries but the main industry that you're going to find tantalum in is the capacitor industry. So a lot of computer chips that are high end will have tantalum capacitors. They can absorb more heat. They can have things flow quickly. Think about copper on super sterile steroids, really, really strong metal to be able to use. But tantalum can also be found in different aviation industries, it can be used to uh, build missiles. Sometimes they'll have tantalum, they'll make it into a really fine wire. And because of its high conductivity and resistance to heat, it's a great uh, uh, great metal to be able to use in things like missiles and things like that. Now we've also seen tantalum used to line furnaces. Again, high heat absorption. So you can have something like this as part of a furnace where you're not going to have it really wear away. And it looks like a regular piece of steel when you look at it quickly, but by analyzing it or knowing that it came out of an industry, a special arc furnace or some type of fabrication, that's going to give you the ability to know. Now this is about one one and a half pounds of tantalum, today's market price, maybe $40 per pound. So this one little piece is $60. And if you ever come across tantalum, it's really interesting and important to really ask the scrapyard to use their analyzers. Now, many scrapyards will not buy tantalum because it's not something that they come across every day like copper, aluminum, or steel. So you might be a little hard pressed to find someone that's willing to buy it. There are specialty tantalum capacitor buyers online that you you would send your tantalum capacitors to and then get paid after receipt. We don't have anyone that we would recommend. We know that they're out there, but if you start sending them the wrong chips, whether they're plastic chips or copper bearing chips, they'll probably say, hey, we're not gonna be interested in doing business with you anymore. So tantalum, again, is not something that you see every day, but we had a question about it, and hopefully this helps educate you and help you learn more about the scrap industry in total. Thanks for watching this video. If you want to and you haven't already, please subscribe below for more videos or become a Patreon supporter to get more information on Scrap today.